Hello everyone. In today's video, we will go through how to solve the scene pick and place basic. Let's jump straight into it. I have made a function block for the two axis picker that I will use and connect my tags to. Let's open up the function block and see how I programmed it. I made a sequence with seven steps to automate the two axis picker. First, I made a rung that starts the whole sequence. To activate the sequence, I connected the item at entry sensor. Once it gets triggered, it will hold the sequence active until the sequence is done. And I made move blocks to go to the next step. I built this up so that the step outputs will be set or reset here and the transitions from the inputs will happen here. At step one, the arm will move down, and it will do so until an item is detected. At step two, the arm will grab the item and move back up. At step three, the arm will move out. At step four, the arm will move down. At step 5, the arm will release the item and then move up again. At step 6, the arm will move back to its home position. And at step 7, the sequence is done and will pulse out a signal to reset the sequence. In my main block, I added some code to make the conveyors running. For the entry conveyor, I made so that once I spawn an item, the conveyor will latch itself and will do so until the item at entry sensor gets occupied. The exit conveyor will start once the exit sensor gets occupied. I also added so the arm shouldn't be moved down to be sure it is on the way up before the conveyor is starting and it will latch itself until I spawn another item. Now let's run the scene while monitoring the code in TIA portal. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. 